in the early days of being an entrepreneur, you're talking about being married to your business. What were some of those sacrifices back in the earlier days? Uh, time. Just time is the most the highest price commodity and value in anybody's life as an entrepreneur and having time. Time to get the work done, time to spend time with family, time to make sure you're having help with your kids. But I had a phenomenal partner, my wife, and uh, it was with the children. I didn't spend a lot of time. I was traveling a lot, doing a lot of different things all over the country. So um, during certain years, I was not around that much. You know, I, I tried to be home at least one day on the for a Sunday or something, but that that's a sacrifice. It also, you know, you sacrifice your health in some respects. And people have to understand you can't go into the entrepreneurship in an unhealthy way because you're more than likely going to get unhealthy because <laughs> you're traveling, you're eating fast food, you're doing whatever you do. And it's 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 insane. It, it's a little if you want to, you know, you, people fantasize the, the, the Elon Musk and all, all the people who have been successful. Um, and there's so many bodies on the ground, like you said, for 90 percent of the people that fail. And I've known a lot of people that have failed. Uh, but what I've seen about them is, is they weren't married to their business. They didn't. They didn't have that tenacity and that energy. I mean, if you're not, if you're a massive introvert, very hard for you to start a business and do it unless you're buying a franchise and you're just going through the motion. Um, and you can do that. But if you're trying to start something unique and, and go after it, yeah, you, you have to. You have to be in it full time. Be right at least the first three years. And please, everybody, don't expect to make money the first three years. Just don't expect to. If you can't do that. It's hard. Sometimes you can, but you just don't expect it. Wow. Three years. That's 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 a sobering three thought when you think about it. Decent money. To start putting in money where you're like, okay, I'm comfortable. Uh, it's usually three years. And let me say this too. One thing I tell some of the people I do work, you know, help. You make the worst decisions in your life when you have the most money in your pocket. Because it's easy to buy things. Ah, oh, I got the money to do it. Ah, oh, let me just try this. Let me do it. Next thing, and you make the best decisions when you don't have any money. So mm -hmm. always lay the groundwork as if you're broke, is what I tell everybody who's asked me how to do this. Always act as if you're broke. Because if you don't, you will be. 